Hi everyone. Let us discuss something about bone and soft tissue sarcoma today. So bone and soft tissue sarcomas are a distinct group of tumors which occurs in and around a bone, joint or in the connective soft tissues like muscles, blood vessels, skin, etc. So most of the time the patients come to us with a common problem of swelling or pain associated with joint movement problem in and around a major limb like femur or tibia or fibula or arms and sometimes the patients can experience pain at night. Most of the time we need to do some scans to know the extent of the tumor and we also need to know the nature of the tumor so a biopsy is sometimes mandatory before initiating any kind of treatment. Different kinds of treatment options are available for treating soft tissue and bone sarcomas and they include but are not limited to operation, chemotherapy and or radiation depending on the nature and stage of the tumor. Radiation holds an important role in managing bone and soft tissue sarcomas which can be given before or after the operation. So when a tumor occurs in and around the joint and the surgeon wants to save the limb and the surgeon doesn't want to go ahead with sacrificing the limb, we can plan radiation in a nice way so that the tumor shrinks before the operation. Many a times after the operation, radiation is given to sterilize the tumor area. There are different ways to deliver radiation like external beam radiation, brachytherapy and occasionally we take the tumor along with the piece of the bone completely out of the patient's body and deliver a very high dose of radiation and again the surgeon places it back to its original position and this specific form of radiation is known as extracorporeal body radiation therapy or extracorporeal radiation therapy which is done at very specific centers. Most of the times the radiation is safe and efficient in controlling the tumor. So I hope you now get some insights about bone and soft tissue sarcomas. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and press the bell icon to get the latest healthcare updates.